I know that last year I had been talking about a whole bunch of stuff really I was going through some trials and things weren't going too great for me and now I have a job with salary and benefits through one of my very good friends fathers and I'm very grateful I'm doing the best I can for them just showing my gratitude daily and always staying humble and remembering that it was nothing but God that got me there I'm so grateful to God um, things have been a little bit difficult emotionally lately and actually it's not work I love work but um, I've been lonely and I keep reminding myself that I don't need to be lonely I've got God you know and he will supply all my needs and give me everything my heart's desire everything my heart desires but that it'll be in his time and I want y'all to remember that that when things get tough and you want things on your time that there's a reason it's not happening exactly how you want it to and I'm telling myself this too as bad as I want certain things like I want a boyfriend I mean not a boyfriend I want a man I'm tired of being single I'm tired of being by myself but I also am tired of doing things the way that I want my way when God has a better plan for me he has somebody out there for me and um it's just a lot of stuff I miss and what's so crazy is I don't want to go out there and find something temporary anymore I like every now and again I'll go out I have a drink or whatever but I end up sitting by myself playing on Facebook or something I know that may not be healthy in itself but I, I just don't want the BS anymore I don't want something temporary you know and if I gotta wait I gotta wait because when it finally happens it's gonna be right I love God so much but I mean I am ready for a man to love me like he loves God I know I don't need it but I've been lonely you know and I know that it was real easy back in the day to find someone to temporarily remove that feeling of loneliness but I also remember always feeling even lonelier afterwards and less of myself so I keep that in mind every time I have those feelings but I also don't feel like empty because I have God in me I've got the spirit in me now so I know that it's working towards something I know that when God brings me the man that he wants for me that I'm gonna be so happy and my daughter is gonna have just somebody in her life that's gonna love us as a family and um, I'm willing to wait it stinks but again it's on God's time if I want it to be right I can make it on my time and I can deal with stuff that I wouldn't have to deal with if I just waited for God so I love you God and I love you Jesus and thank you for the spirit you put in me but real talk I, I'm just so ready and, and maybe he doesn't think I'm ready yet you know my new career move is taking up a lot of my time and um I'm happy when I'm there you know but that also kind of worries me a little bit because why am I happier at work than just when I'm on my own time I know that it is probably a good thing my focus for once in my life is toward building a future for myself and my daughter but I go home and I'm just lonely so I keep God in my heart and I trust him I don't know if I'm asking for advice or if I'm just kind of venting a little bit and I know everyone says you don't need a man right now you don't need a man and I know I don't need a man but I'm 35 years old and I've also never really had a real man and I'm starting to really like want to know what it's like and really want to be there for somebody really want to like hold somebody down and have somebody want to hold me down even more you know and encourage me to get up in the morning and pray and you know have fun with and, and communicate with and go through that process I'm almost 35 I'll be 35 in one week 
but um, I don't know. I really don't know why I made this video. But hey world, God's amazing. A year ago I never thought I'd have a salary with benefits and bonuses and stuff. I never thought that I was worthy of that. Never thought on top of being worthy of it that I'd excel at it. And it, it just feels so good when people come up to me and tell me how good I'm doing. Like, y'all don't understand how, how that feels. So thank you for everyone that's giving me a compliment. But, um, just, I guess, get at me, pray for me, words of wisdom, whatever, as long as they come from the heart. I don't want any words of wisdom from someone who's had a bad experience and, and just has bitterness. I don't even know if I want any opinions, really, at all. I just had to get this off my chest. Keep your faith in God. Don't ever give up on Him. He's never given up on you. He's given me everything I've ever needed. Things that I couldn't even believe could have happened to me. So I will continue to trust him and understand that his way is the best. And I also want to thank him for opening my heart so that I could see the changes and see the things that I need to change and, and to soften me up a little bit so I could be a woman to somebody. Maybe I'm still in that process. I don't know. I'm a little ruggish. <laughs> but... I don't know. I will talk to y'all soon. Hey, Facebook. Hey, YouTube. Bye.